and welcome, welcome, Miss Julie Strand. This is Shanice with your oracle, excuse me, video oracle card reading for this May 11th, 2011. Your question you asked is, what should you be focusing on for this year? Alrighty, I'm tuning in into you now, and I'm about to draw three cards, and we're going to find out. Um, actually, I'm going to be using, with you, the Ask Your Guides Oracle Card Deck, produced by Sonia Choquette. So we're going to find out, through the guides, what you should be focusing on for this year. Alrighty. Let's see. Alrighty, pick some cards and one, two, three. Alright, first card, Miss Judy Strand, Master Teachers, School. That's the first thing that pop into mind and are getting me actually to focus on that grafting chart the graph chart something up with you in graphs in school that should be part of your focus for this year that is your frame of mind going back to school learning definitely a big one alrighty so the master teachers, they always help with teaching. So learning is a good thing. That's part of it. On to the third card. Oops. Third card. Restriction. Your joy guides. Now here, this card is letting me know that you're tightening up and you're restricted and it's time to ask your joy guys to help you release that restrictness to get it out your mind it really feels like some fear some doubt and the joy guides right there are showing me that they're helping you get out of your head see the little man right there he's well she is locked in your head you need to get out of your head in order to focus on your math with your master teachers on your schooling whatever you're trying to learn get that doubt they're also telling me meditation definitely but the joy guides are definitely there to help you get out of that negative space to get out of your head and get into your heart to get focused on your learning and then i'm hearing graduation too are you stressed out with graduation AP. Anything about AP, like AP classes? That sounds so high schoolish, but that's what I'm hearing. AP classes. Now I'm hearing accounting. So, statistics of that nature. You have to get out of your head and start focusing with your heart. Alrighty. And the next card, last card is rest the holy spirit and right off the bat turning that card over i hear meditation resting relaxing they're getting me the focus on the person chilling right there reading the book because it really feel it really feels like a lot of stress a lot of stress with you so what you that's actually the card that you you need to what you need to become aware of is rest is key you have to rest you can't burn yourself out and your body your soul your when everything is working in order your body will let you know it's just that we live in a time right now where we're going 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 and it seems like nobody wants to sit and rest nobody wants to just do nothing there is a law out there called the law of doing nothing and that's when you just sit back and you chill just like the person in this picture and i'm hearing let go and let god 
focusing on the dove right here. So let go, let God, and all will be well. So your focus this year is mainly focusing on school, not letting stuff get to your head and be all stressed out, and remembering to rest. And I'm hearing exercise. Hey, exercise is good. Exercise is, is good for you. It helps get you actually out of your head, excuse me, and into your heart. And like I said, rest is so, so key. So that is your focus for this year, Miss Julie Strand. Alrighty, that is your video, Oracle Card Reading. I hope this reading finds you well, Miss Judy Strand. And you have an awesome, awesome, awesome weekend and an awesome, awesome, awesome day. And I look forward to hearing from you. Bye. Love ya.